Hi, my name is Darby Cockrell. Um, I am applying for the 2018 spring semester of nursing. Um, I am 20 years old. I live in Lindale, Texas, um, but I do attend UT Tyler. Um, this is my first semester actually at um, UT Tyler. Um, when I first moved here, I attended one semester at TJC to catch up on some of the core curriculum that I didn't have in Ohio that we have here in Texas. Um, ever since my junior year of high school is when I decided that I wanted to be a nurse. Um, I originally set out to be, um, go into athletic training. Um, I've always been very involved in sports and I had trainers myself and just wanted to join in on something like that, um, to stay kind of in the athletic realm. But after doing more research on nursing itself, I figured that would probably be a better bet for me. And so far, I've loved it. Um, I want to start with some of my strengths. Um, I work well in teams. Sorry. I work well in teams. Like I mentioned before, I have played softball for about 14 years now. Um, so being 14 years of softball, obviously, I've had to work with a team every single time. Also been in sports like basketball. Um, sorry about my cat in the background. Um I actually played one year of college softball at Miss Kingham University in Columbus, Ohio. Um, that took a lot and a lot of hard work. Um, actually, when I started playing softball when I was about, well, when I was in second grade, um, I was actually very behind all of the other girls um, in my age group. And I just, it was something I was passionate about and I never stopped working. Um, so I actually got my spot myself into a position that I was getting recruited my junior year of high school. Um, and by the, be the end of my junior year, I had decided where I wanted to go. Um, I'm also good at problem solving and quick thinking. Again, this relates back to softball. Being on the field, you only have a split second to react and decide what you're going to do, where you're going to go with that out, and what your game plan is. Um, that also evolve, involves a lot of communication, not only just between teammates, but between coaches and umpires and everybody around you. You have to be able to read um, what signals they're putting out to you and know how to react to them in the appropriate way. I also use this a lot um, in my job. I'm actually a salesman at Velocity Mazda here in Tyler. Um, again, it's just about communication. It's being able to relate to someone and give them as much information as possible and doing it in a very polite and concise way but also doing it quickly. Um, I'm actually really responsible. Um, my mom is a flight attendant for American Airlines and my dad is in the business of roofing um, so they both travel a lot for their jobs. Um, so a lot of times I'm left at home um, by myself so not only do I have to take care of myself but we have two cats um, a week ago we had put one of our dogs down, but we had three dogs and two horses as well. Um, not only do my parents depend on me for things like that, um, we're actually new to our neighborhood, obviously, you know, since we haven't been here that long, but my neighbors have already started depending on me if they go out of town, need to, someone to take care of their house or their animals, they'll give me a call. Um, also as, as well, they have younger daughters, so if they're out of town, or just away for a couple days and their daughters are home, um, I'll go up and check on them or watch after them or whatever they need. Um, also, a lot of my friends call on me for help. Um, I'm pretty active in like the automotive community. Um, most of the time when somebody gets a flat tire, or has some kind of issue, they'll call on me. Um, or even just things like if somebody's gone out and isn't able to drive home that night, um, I'm the one they come to to get home safely, and I do it without hesitation. Um, a few of my experiences that have led me to want to be a nurse, um, I was actually, when we were still living in Ohio, um, on a trip back from Texas, we stopped in Louisville, Kentucky. I was actually dead asleep in the car, and there was an accident in front of us, and um, the young girl had lost attention in the road for a second and 
rear end of the car in front of her was at a dead stop, and I don't think she had slowed down at all. Um, she had missing her teeth and everything, and I can remember her describing that she thought the glass had broken in her mouth from the windshield, but it was actually her teeth just broken into pieces in her mouth. Um, so I stood by her side until EMS was able to arrive. Um, I also uh, didn't have a neck brace, but I was afraid she could have had a neck injury just from the whiplash, so I had to brace her neck with my hands until they got there. Um, I'm also certified in first aid and CPR, and I have been since my junior year of high school. Um, I've also done some volunteer work in nursing homes. Um, I was in Girl Scouts when I was younger, and we did a lot of community service hours, especially um, in the nursing home. Um, also, another cool experience I had is my brother had LASIK surgery on his eyes, and um, the doctor was actually cool enough to let me come into the surgical room and watch the procedure. So that was really, really interesting to me. Um, another thing that brought me into nursing. Also, my aunt um, is a nurse. She started out working in the neonatal unit and at uh, the University of Michigan. Um, she worked her way up to a nurse practitioner and now she's a care flight nurse. Um, I think that's pretty awesome. Um, and also, I just love being around people. Um, I coached a seven, eight year old softball team um, this past year, and it was probably one of the funnest things I've ever done. Um, it was great, just the feeling I received being able to spread confidence to young girls that they can do whatever they set their minds to, and the responsibility of having to keep up with 13, seven, and eight year olds. Um, they're a handful, but it was so much fun, and I would love to do it again. Um, Thank you for your time, and I look forward to starting nursing at UT Tyler. Thank you.